What's going on everybody? This is Lee Baris and I have a quick tutorial here for you. I know a lot of you are starting to use MSI Afterburner to record videos, which is a great functionality of this uh, free software and I'm glad they're developing it. But one thing it is missing is live commentary. So there is a workaround which as you can see I do. Um, the first thing you'll need to do is go to your sound properties here in uh, Windows. Then under your playback tab, yes the playback tab not recording, double click on speakers hit levels and increase rare pink in and microphone to a hundred and make sure they're both unmuted um, some of you may have front pink in instead of rare pink in uh, you'll, if you have that you'll need to bring that to a hundred also once you have that go to your recording tab and make sure you enable stereo mix right here sometimes it might not show up so make sure you right click here and show disabled devices show disconnected devices then it should show up for you so enable that and make that your default uh, communication device instead of the microphone and uh, you do not need to set that to listen or anything like that just make sure the levels up on that and uh, that should be good to go then in MSI Afterburner once you open it up as I already did you go to settings here then you hit your video capture tab and down here make sure you down mix multi-channel audio to stereo enable audio capture you want to set this to wasapi capture device and audio source not auto select but stereo mix and that should do it for you um, it is sort of like listening to yourself but there's a lot less delay and it's much quieter so it's a decent workaround and I'll use that until I ever implement the record and commentate feature if you have any questions comments or concerns please let me know in the comments below and I will try to respond and that's it for this tutorial with Gamer Libre's failing more every day